this is a project that is literally going to cost you about four dollars okay so what you're gonna need is a brown towel and this is a hand towel a green towel some mini rubber bands and either a stuffed toy or a pillow now I chose this toy because it has eyes so I'm able to not only utilize the stuffing from the toy but I'm able to use the eyes for baby Yoda as well you're also going to need a glue gun and glue sticks if you don't have a glue gun you can grab one in Walmart they're literally so cheap it's not even funny um, I think the glue gun is like three dollars and what I use is the Gorilla Glue glue sticks they're the best ones that I found and I think this 30 pack is like four dollars so this basically takes two glue sticks all right so a stuffed toy with eyes mini rubber bands a green towel and a blue towel a blue towel hello a brown towel all right you guys I'm gonna take all the tags off and then we're gonna get started All right, everyone, what I did was I opened up the toy so I could access the stuffing. I popped out the eyes, okay, because we're gonna need those later. And we're gonna start our baby Yoda. So you're gonna start with your green towel. Move that out a little bit. And you are going to basically fold it in half, okay? And what you're going to do is you're going to glue the two sides down, okay? Make sure it's pretty even. Okay, so you're going to take the two sides and you're going to glue them down. same thing to the other side this is going to make the ears and the arms so it has to be glued down I mean if you're handy and you can sew then go for it sew your heart out I am NOT that great at sewing so I prefer the glue method. Plus it works just as well. And the great thing with hot glue is it dries so fast, you guys. All right, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take each corner and you're going to gather it for the ear okay so just gather the top corner and take one of your mini rubber bands and some of them will pop so don't get discouraged there it's a mini rubber band okay and just secure your ear Okay, and you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Now you can adjust this once you've got it by just moving your rubber bands up or down. Okay. 
You want to make sure, you know, that they're kind of even. Uh, you might want the ears to be a, a little bit longer. So all you would do is just move your rubber bands down a little bit because they're already in there. So you're good. Okay, so we have baby Yoda's ears all set. Now you're going to take your toy and pull some of the stuffing out. And you're going to fill it between the ears to make baby Yoda's head. I'm basically using the stuffing that was in this stuffed dog's head. I mean, you want to get a good amount in there, okay, because you want to make sure that his head is, you know, really stuffed and you don't have, like, too much, like, you're going to want to play here and just pull that area out. going to want to pull baby Yoda together pull the head together okay just the rubber bands if you need to that's not permanent so you can you know adjust as you need shaped baby Yoda's head okay so you want to take a rubber band and you want to tie off the head now the amazing thing about these mini rubber bands is they are strong as hell okay easy peasy right and you can adjust the stuffing once it's in there. Okay. Now you're going to form his arms. So you've got these two areas, right? So you're going to need two rubber bands. And you're just going to take these two bottom corners. and rubber band them to make his arms. Easy, right? This is one of the easiest projects you'll pretty much ever make. Plus it's super cute. So do the same thing on the other side. Rubber band them arms. Adjust his head as need be. Okay, and then you're going to take the rest of the stuffing that's in your, your toy or your pillow. And you're going to fill the bottom. Or the body, whatever you want to call it. And you don't need much because you don't have that big of an area left. Now, depending on what you're using Baby Yoda for, like, I just have mine in the bathroom, so I didn't really seal up the bottom, but you can. All you have to do is just take your hot glue gun and seal it on up and you're good. Okay, so now we're going to make his robe. So this is where your brown towel is going to come in. You're going to open it up and you can remove the tags if you need to. You're going to open this on up. Okay. You've got baby Yoda here. Okay. 
and you're going to take your round towel, lay it out. Okay. I always work on cardboard because of the um, hot glue gun. And you're going to adjust where you want the towel to be on his head. Now, you don't have to do this at all. You can take the towel instead and kind of wrap it around and do the whole neck thing. I think it looks cuter this way. But you can do whatever you want here. Okay. So you're going to take this. And right in the middle, you're just going to do a little dot of hot glue and glue it down. This is going to hold your robe into place. All right, so you see where your ears are, right? You wanna go about halfway down the ear and just pop a scissor into your towel, make a little slit. And pull that ear on through. Okay. See so that? You're going to do the same thing on the other side. I just take where the ear is. I go about halfway down and just pop a slit into the towel and pop the ear through. Boom, easy, right? Okay, sorry guys. I will definitely work on this set because I'm working on the floor and it is horrible right now. But, all right, we gotta get this baby done. All right, so you wanna leave this area in the front so you can close his robe off and all that good stuff, but we're getting there. Okay, we're getting there. So you want to leave a decent amount. Just make sure you pull it down a little bit. Okay, now we're going to work on his arms. So where the arm is, halfway through, cut a slit, pop the arm through. Boom, easy. Now you can, anything you need to, like any little strings, you can cut them off. You're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Cut that slit, pop that arm through. There's really, honestly, there's no messing this up because there's so many like little adjustments you can make. It's not even funny. All right. So here you're going to want to pull your robe forward. Now here's also where you can get that, that look that you want across or I and the one in my bathroom I left open so I could put um whatchamacallit so I could put flowers in his hands but you don't have to do that you with some folding just go across pull it up and you're good you see what I mean so we'll do this one like that. So we'll take the hot glue and we will secure it right there. And as you can see, it's already very, very rope-like. Now, if you want his hands to be higher, you're going to do that. So you're going to, you're just going to kind of play with them for a second, see where you want them. So, dot of hot glue there, easy peasy, right? And 
we'll do a dot of hot glue here. And now we have his arms in place. We're also, that's why I love hot glue too. I'm gonna do a dot of hot glue in here. So that stays as well. Anywhere you feel like you need to secure it, hot glue that bitch. Hot glue is your best friend. At least hot glue is my best friend. Okay? Easy, right? All right. Now, I pulled these eyes out. You can use two marbles. You can use whatever you want. So, what I like to do is just set the first eye first, or I think it should be. As you can see, I just got my hand stuck in that hot glue that I didn't secure down. So I made a little, oh, I did not actually. Okay, there we go. Made a little hole. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put a little bit of hot glue and I'm going to stick that eye right into that hole. See that? Easy, right? Now I have hot glue on my hand. I'm going to do the same thing. A little bit of hot glue. Stick it right in there. How adorable is that, you guys? Okay, now, again, depending on what you're using it for, I just have mine kind of chilling in my bathroom. You can take the rest of your stuffed toy if you want, stuff it in there, okay? Seal up his robe, seal up the bottom. I usually like to kind of leave it so I can, you know, just stand him up and adjust the robe as I want to. But up to you, again. Um, for this one, I will seal it up so you can see. So I'll just take the toy and kind of put its legs into its body. Because, I mean, what else are you going to do with this, right? You're going to throw it out. And stick it up in there. And then you just kind of stand him up. He'll stand up on his own and you are good to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Share the video, you guys. Um, I'm going to get it all edited and get it up for you. If there's anything that you guys want to see, a craft, anything, let me know. Um, I have some more exciting stuff coming to you this week. But once your Yoda is up also, you know, and you take a look at it, that's when you can, like, adjust his ears, make sure, you know, it's straight, whatever. But I think he looks super cute. So have a great day, you guys. I'll see you soon.